You keep away from me with that, Jared. Oh my God, I just saw what, what my next guest is. So in honor of President's Day, we're going to meet some presidential pets. Uh, all of us got to know the Obama dogs, Bo and Sonny, of course. Now we're going to see some of the more exotic pets that presidents have kept. I do not believe that any president was allowed to keep this because it could kill the president. But please welcome animal expert, Jared Miller. I'll be over here. So Jared. Hey, too, you, look, you look a little pale. You are dressed like a president today. You look I very am. dapper. Well, thank you very much. Did you notice the alligator, though? Yes, okay. the alligator, I think, wants to eat our next guest. Right. Um, why are you yeah, holding an out? No, I'm not going to sit next no, to the alligator. <laughs> it's not going down. Um, hmm. Why are you holding an alligator? Well, you know, the interesting thing, President's Day is one of my favorite holidays. But what's amazing is that throughout the American presidency, People don't really realize how many cool pets presidents have had over the years and what kind of animals actually lived in the White House. This guy here is an American alligator. John Quincy Adams, our sixth president, uh -huh. had an alligator as a pet that was given to him by um, Marquis de Lafayette as a present. He kept it in the bathtub in the White House and he used to scare all the dignitaries that would come to the White House <laughs> with an alligator. Did anybody ever take the alligator for a walk, or did they get him a presidential lap pool? What was it just say? And Who keeps an alligator? Like, that's nuts. And I'm you might, sorry. And you might think that's odd. You can pet him. He's a beautiful guy. This is Curly, by the way. Curly is about almost a 30-year-old alligator. But he's Curly's not that big. He's a little guy. He's a little guy. Well, an alligator like this, he'll get quite large. He'll get almost 15 feet long, weigh almost 800 pounds. But again, you might think that only one alligator. It's odd that one alligator lives in the White House. Herbert Hoover's son actually had two alligators as pets, uh -huh. and they used to just run free around the White House grounds. What do they, now this is sincere, what, what do they eat? What do you feed a pet alligator? Pretty much alligators eat whatever fits in their mouth, really. <laughs> they could bite down with 200 pounds of pressure, but really an alligator in the wild, you know, like this guy's found in Louisiana, and you know, southeast United States, fish and rodents, uh, you know, fingers, whatever. That's. Really charming. Can we move, Curly? You're yeah, very Curly. Nice. We'll let Curly go back to you that. You look great for 30. I'll be over here. Yeah, there we go. Now. Please don't let him bite my next guest. 